the most publicized soldier since Napoleon, uh, Elvis Presley, with girlfriend Priscilla Beaulieu to see him off, was leaving Frankfurt at the end of his army service. So it was farewell to military glory and a 16-year-old Priscilla. What fame for that girl to have been a friend of the emperor of... By the time Elvis returned home, the raw and earthy sound of rock and roll had been sanitized. Suggestive lyrics, wild guitars, and frenzied dance maneuvers were giving way to songs about moonlight romance. The tragic deaths of two of its greatest stars would come to signify the end of an era. Just you know why. Why? Why can I have one of my own? I'm so lonely, so alone. A lot of people say it is, man, but I'll I, I tell you, uh, it has changed some. The music itself has changed. It, it, it's progressed quite a bit, I, I think. It's better. Uh, I think it's getting better all the time, you know, because the, the, uh, the arrangements are getting better. They're adding more instruments and, you know, so forth. <laughs> The teen idols were mostly cuddly, milder clones of Elvis, invariably sporting a sizable quiff and wailing of heartbreak. Their ice cream pop came to dominate the charts in the late 50s, early 60s. This teen sound was simply a smoother take on early Elvis ballads, such as First in Line and I Was the One. A balladeer at heart, he would make the refined style his own throughout the 60s. Detail some of your future plans. Well, the first thing I have to do is to cut some records. And then after that, I have the television show with, uh, with Frank Sinatra. And then I have the, the picture with Mr. Wallace. And then, uh, after that, I have two for 20th Century Fox. And after that, heaven knows. I don't know. The same way, only in different areas. The Frank Sinatra Welcome Home Show was a resounding success. The remainder of 1960 produced an amazing 59 songs, including the huge hit, It's Now or Never, along with completion of three feature films. The album released later that year said it all. Elvis is back.